Good morning, cult members, and welcome to Pop Culture Cult. I'm Sean. I'm Janice. That's right. I said good morning. <laughs> it is Labor Day here for us in the States, which means we don't have to do any labor except for vacuum the apartment. Right. <laughs> pretty much what it comes down to uh but this is going to be our review non-spoiler review of mulan yes dropped on disney plus this weekend um if you paid extra if you paid extra <laughs> it will be free in december and um spoilers for our score at the end wait till december right uh we actually uh this was one of our movies that i think we both were looking forward to this year in the movie theater, in the theater yeah we had actually kind of um, pointed out a couple times when we saw the trailers in the movie theater that this looked visually amazing. Yes, yeah, really cool, big panning shots and lots um, of colors. Lots of colors, vibrant. and it would have been very cool in Dolby, and the sound was very cool, mm -hmm. and all that stuff. Uh, and the cast is all amazing. Yep. Um, the the girl who plays Mulan, <sighs> Yifi Lin. I'm oh, I'm just going to tell you now. Lou. I have. Huh? Lou, Lou. Lou. Yeah. Um, I'm going to tell you now that uh, I have a hard enough time with English names. <laughs> so, yes. um, but she's really good yep. as Mulan, yep. uh, and I and I really enjoy like what she did and what she brought to the character itself. Yes. Um, and then we yep. got you know uh, uh, Donnie Yen and Jet Li, who's Jet Li's completely underused. Yeah, um, I would say. I mean, Donnie. Um, Donnie Yen. Mm -hmm. Donnie Yen had some good, um, uh, I don't know what his style is. Uh, fight um, scenes. Fight <laughs> scenes. That, but they weren't, there was no fighting. It yeah. was him just kind of showing off. Yeah, yeah. Um, That's kind of his MO though too, so. Right, but he never actually had any fight scenes. It was just him up there doing his yeah, thing yeah um and then he was a uh he is a commander so right so um, he's like a general of the of the troops or whatever so he just rode around on a horse the whole time yeah yeah and and jet Li, wh who plays the emperor doesn't get to do any jet Li stuff no and has the weirdest headdress at the end um <laughs> it's vertical blinds it's, it's vertical with blinds the, with the yeah it is it now we have no emotional attachment to the animated version right um i think i've seen part of it once like it was never a, a big movie for me to watch and yeah see. i've probably watched the whole thing once maybe because our daughter was about that age right. when it came out so and, and but um so i was i i i knew the general story but i'm kind of going into this blind and i found that it it spent too much time dragging along um trying to build an emotional connection with mulan and um her army mates and and all that stuff and and i just uh, uh for a movie that was for me at least i took it as a um here's a girl um becoming a woman her own type of woman that story is there but it was also kind of told us uh, the the that there was going to be you know you know the trailer showed big fight scenes yeah. and and epic you know kind of that uh hidden dragon or crouching tiger hidden dragon kind of feel and it had that but only like in spurts yeah and it was and i'm not saying that this is wrong or anything but i just if you're going to promote it this way, I feel like it needs to be that. And I just never, what, I never really felt like it got there enough for me. Yeah. Yeah. And, um, we kind of, so the other third of pop culture cult, yeah, jo uh, Josh, um, him and his wife were the ones that paid for it. We weren't really going to pay for it because it wasn't that big of a deal for us, but they paid for it. So we had our first four way into going to a friend's house yeah, since the whole yeah, yeah. coronavirus happened, which was exciting. Um, but uh, uh, as we kind of talked about it after it was over uh, with them, if this is supposed to be a kid's Disney movie, it's after a kid's Disney cartoon. Right. Um, children are going to be bored. There was yeah. nothing in this that was going to... There wasn't the cute... You know, there wasn't a talking dragon or the cute, right. you know, um, um, 
but a poor or forest animal, forest animal, you know, something. Or, yeah. Was it something like that to kind of keep kids engaged? Um, and that's that was a choice they made, and I'm okay with that choice. But if you're, I'm this uh, it. Uh, 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 <laughs> this audience the audience it feels like they're going for is that you know 11 to 13 year old girl right and there's not even a lot of 11 to 13 year old girl stuff in it either there's a little bit of the trying to find yourself right your true self right um which is the overall story right but it kind of once they once Mulan finally decides that she needs to find her true self, it's kind of yada yada into a okay, I got it figured out, let's go. Yeah. And 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 it's just it I just it just I, I'm I guess the more I think about it, the more I'm just disappointed in in I just I wasn't emo emotionally connected to it at all. Yeah, yeah. And it, yeah, it um it needed to pick a thing and go with that. Like we would have been okay if it was just visually stunning. <laughs> yeah. And I'm sure yeah. in the movie theater it would be. Yeah. And it was it was nice, you know, and, and it's not like we saw it on a small screen. It was, you know, we yeah. saw it on a big TV. Um, it, it probably would have been better if we had seen it in the movie theater because we could have at least really enjoyed that part. Yeah. Um, but, yeah, the bad guy girl there's a, a bad guy uh jason lee who uh we all talked about after the fact we he's bruce lee you can't get over he's bruce lee yeah, he plays bruce lee in the bruce and lee we, story and, and you can't stop seeing bruce lee and we, and we try really hard not to do that but with this it felt like bruce lee trying the guy who played bruce lee trying to be um a disney villain because yeah. he is a disney villain and it just it, I would say the witch is more a Disney villain. Yeah. So there's a bad guy, Jason Lee, and then there's a bad girl, and I don't remember it, what it, her name yeah, is. Yeah, that's her. Lee Gong. Lee Gong is the um, actress, actress's name. The actress's name, and we've seen her in something else because she looked very familiar, but she's a witch, um, and she's like evil, 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 not. And you're like, wait a minute. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> the, mm, okay. She had this epiphany. Again, with the <laughs> we've we've de the the characters have decided something, and we just kind of instead of giving a mi minute to breathe or giving it um, uh, some exposition or whatever, it's just kind of yada yada. You, you know, yeah. here you go. And, yeah, and, and there was no like. Normally, when a bad, when a villain turns, I don't know, they would say good, but gets redeemed in the end, you, there's a progression of yeah. them saying, this isn't right, yeah. I don't like what I'm doing, I don't like these people, whatever, um, that kind of gets them there, and that never happened. She was evil, 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 and then she was not. Yeah. And you're like, yeah. huh. Yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm all... all Although I'm really happy for, you know, everybody was involved and, and I'm not saying... A lot of those people don't get the opportunity to be in yes, a, yes. It, all Asian. I don't think everyone in it was Chinese. This is a Chinese story. Um, I don't think, I don't think everyone in it was Chinese, but yeah. that's fine. Um, you know, it's a Asian culture movie and that's awesome. That's and awesome. And, and everybody got to be... They, they, there was no real like you know uh i never felt like it was an empowerment kind of like you know we're trying to be they just you they just were they were just the characters which is how yeah, it's, it's supposed to be story. and and i and i and i'm really happy for all of that i'm I, i'm not saying that i i don't think that there shouldn't be more um uh, with this group and this particular with this particular group but um with this group i'm going to say group again um <laughs> but i just i i'm 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 fairly disappointed. Yeah. I think it. they could have added the movie's only like an hour and a half. And it's uh I think it was 40. 156 or something really? like that one on on the ten, yeah. Oh, okay. I was thinking it was shorter than that cuz they could have probably added another 10 or 15 minutes and 
and fleshed out the story a little bit better, and that probably would have I helped. I think if they added 10, 15 more minutes uh, and done that, or they could have taken out 10 or 15 minutes and just kind of go with the a faster pace. Yeah. Uh, even the fight sequences felt leisurely in pace. Yeah. <laughs> Yeah, I won't, I won't say slow, but it was it was definitely a leisurely pace, yeah. and and uh, so I'm glad we didn't pay for it. I'm glad that Josh and Audrey paid for it. I'm glad <laughs> we got to see them. I'm glad that we got to, to spend some time with our friends. But uh, overall, with this particular movie, I'm not I'm I'm fairly disappointed. Yeah, Let's, it's probably not something we will watch again when yeah, it comes out for free on Disney Plus. I, I don't care. Uh, let's score it. <sighs> I'm going to give it a two again. Visually, it, it was awesome. Probably even better on the big screen, yeah, but um, I'm, I'm, prob I'm probably at a two as well. So that is our thoughts and mostly non-spoiler review of, <laughs> of Mulan. <laughs> what did you guys think of the movie on our uh, reaction review of it? Let us know in the comments down below. Please be nice. I know we were kind of critical of this movie, and I'm sure it impacts somebody a lot more than it impacted us. Yeah. It, just, it just didn't hit with us, and that's that Our happens. opinion, it's not fact. And everybody's got an <laughs> asshole, so just take that as you take it. So let us know in the comments. Like I said, be nice. Like this video. Subscribe to the channel. Hit the bell for notifications. And follow us on all of our social media stuff, Facebook, Instagram, Twitter. Twitter. <laughs> and until next time, cult members, if we don't see you, good afternoon, good evening, and good night now.